The new purchase order matching functionality with Index Prepare now means that the purchase's workflow is even more streamlined and efficient than before. What I will do is just show you where the benefits are of now using this functionality, jumping into Zero and then into Prepare. In Xero, as we can see, it's possible to create purchase orders. I won't go into the details of how to create a purchase order. Once it's created, you can then send it on to your supplier. Now, historically, what would happen is, once a purchase order's been raised, invoice comes in, that invoice would be processed in prepare. The risk of that is the user has to remember to jump back into their accounting system to mark a purchase order as being billed. If they forget to do that, then this list here actually becomes more confusing, isn't up to date, and doesn't give a true picture. Now, the benefit of the purchase order matching now with Index Prepare is this process is all automated for you. If we were to look at this purchase order here of £42, we'll just jump into Prepare, and what we can see is this invoice is now being received. The amount's £42, but what we now have is if there is a purchase order match, this functionality pops up and we can actually find the purchase order and agree to that. Now, what we can also do is open that purchase order in zero, just to double check. But if we're happy that that is the correct purchase order, we can select it in Dex Prepare. What that will do is update the system in Prepare and also in zero as you can see we have the option here to mark as build if we're happy with all the details as before we can publish the item if we jump back into zero and if we just refresh that page what we'll be able to see is the 42 pounds has disappeared and it's moved into the bill section and the invoice is sat on the purchase ledger within the accounting system so this functionality now really streamlines the process from purchase order through to invoice, ensures that you're keeping an up-to-date list of purchase orders that may be outstanding. And that in turn will mean that when the accountant is pulling the numbers together, they will know whether they should be accruing any outstanding purchase orders. Have they received the stock for all the purchase orders? what's the current state of play. And if you imagine a long list of purchase orders, without this functionality, it would have been quite a time consuming exercise to manually go through each purchase order and identify whether it's been billed or not. Now with Match, that process is automated. Thank you.